Hey, welcome to the Farmington Broadcasting Media Technology Education Area. I'm Mark Tauchi, Mr. Tauchi. Uh, we also have Mr. Mathis here. He's actually doing the filming for us today. But uh, we just wanted to kind of give you like a, a behind the scenes look at uh, what you can expect uh, for this coming year. So we're going to take you on like this little mini tour and uh, show you what you can expect. So this one is uh, Final Cut Studio Audio Studio One. Um, we've got students that come in here and they can record uh, voiceovers. They'll cut some audio for their news packages, uh, radio commercials, PSAs. Uh, we use uh, uh, GarageBand and then we can uh, export it and we can bring it into Adobe Premiere or we can bring it into Adobe Audition. So, And then uh, sometimes our radio students will um, do uh, uh, live broadcasts in here too. So a um, whole bunch of different things that we can do. Two microphones, if uh, two students want to do a show together, they can do that and do some voice tracking. It's kind of a cool thing. Um, kind of the same setup in here. We've got two of these rooms. Same thing here. We've got GarageBand. We've got the internet. We can pull in some music. They can do voice tracking, uh, record that, record it to a flash drive, save it to a flash drive, and then bring it into, uh, edit into their audio software. So moving on to the next room. This is our master control room where we uh, produce Tiger News. We've got a technical director, we've got a, our director, we've got our graphics person, we've got our avid, re, uh, avid playback person, we've got our weather graphics person using the Globecaster. And so this room is ba basically chaos during a live show. Uh, it's teamwork, uh, happens a lot in here. So, a lot of fun, and uh, they get to produce the show. We usually run about six cameras uh, for a live show. Camera one, two, three are at the desk. Four is our weather, which is plugged into our Globecaster. <clears throat> and then five and six is our, our interview cameras that we have out in the studio, which we'll show you in just a little bit. All right, we're moving on to, let's go into the radio station next. The radio station. <clears throat> so we just got this uh, room all situated again. Uh, shout out to KDWB for the inspiration. Uh, we've got four microphones here. Morning shows typically have uh, anywhere from two to four people working on the air at any given time on a morning show. So I kind of wanted to incorporate that into Farmington High School. We also have the main microphone here if you're doing a solo show. You've got your soundboard here, you've got your, you've got your weather forecast. We also will record all of the student stuff here again. Uh, we use GarageBand. Um, and then we also will play back our music using iTunes. We're not too high tech, but hey, it works. Um, one other thing that I also do is uh, I like to uh, personalize things for the students. So, <clears throat> this is uh, Gage's uh, legal ID that he'll play during his show. You're listening to DJ Psycho here on 192.1 Google, Farmington High School. So what they can, what my students can do is they can, going from one song to the next one, they can play their personal liner and have that little break so they don't have to talk if they don't want to. They can do their weather forecast, they can talk about how good the Vikings are doing, yes, awesome. And, uh, but I love to do that for my students. I do, I do a personal liner for each uh, one of my students and uh, save that. It takes about a couple hours to do that, but hey, anything for my students, they rock. Now we're gonna move into, let's go in here. This is our editing room. We got uh, some new computers. We've got uh, Adobe, uh, no, Adobe Premiere Pro that we're using for editing. So we have 12 editing stations in here. And um, so what we'll typically do is we have uh, student groups that will be producing TV commercials, uh, public service announcements, and then the big project that all the students look forward to at the end of the trimester is the music video. So typically we'll have the students working together on a group and they're working with the computer and splicing, editing, adding graphics, fixing the music, things like that. 
This is also used by our Tiger News uh, photographers and videographers and editors, and they will edit their features in here. We also have instruction here. We'll, we'll do some lectures off of here. We'll project it up onto the wall using the projector, and uh, that way we get all of our students on the same page as far as, as editing and how to do things and how to edit. The, the intro to video kids, they come in here with basically a limited knowledge on filming and editing, and we, we bring them all the way to where they, where they know how to do everything in here. So, All right, we're going to move to, let's go in here. This is our classroom where we'll meet. Uh, I've even thought about just taking the tables out, taking the chairs out, because this is a class where like you don't sit, okay? So I've thought about taking them out, but I never do because, well, we need a place to sit and just kind of have like a home base. So anyway, all right, let's go in here. This is our audio control room. We've got two Final Cut systems here that uh, our advanced students will use. We're using Final Cut 6 on both of these. So Mr. Mathis' uh, headquarters. Our video cameras for video production too for Tiger News. They can check those out. And then we also record our show. Uh, we uh, record it onto an Avid system, which is kind of our backup system. But then we also bring in a laptop here on a Mac using Final Cut and we'll record our show, then we upload it to YouTube. That's probably how you're watching this right now. This is our audio uh, board, and so all of the microphones, the sound, the music, everything that we do as far as sound comes into the board, and uh, we can play our music. Here again, we have GarageBand, we have iTunes. It's like, uh, we don't have to change anything as far as technology. iTunes works for us great. Um, we'll send out the signal. We go live to, I just heard the final count, we have 2,239 kids in the school. So Tiger News will be broadcast live every Friday to 2,239 kids. So awesome. Can't wait. Actually, you know what? We'll be having 28 of those working in, on Tiger News. So that's a good thing. All right. So now we're going to go, going to go into the TV studio. Here, let's hit this one first. This is our recording area, recording studio, if you want to call that, call it that. Video production one, when they do a TV commercial or a PSA or whatever, we don't allow them to like use the latest top 40 hit from Selena Gomez or Justin Bieber. We make them, we make them come in and we make them record their own music. Okay, so. This allows them to get a little bit more creative, gives them more ownership of their, of their project. And then they can, they can create music beds, they can create multi-track layer beds. So we've got a whole bunch of different options, thousands of sounds that they can, they can do. We record it into a computer here, we'll export it out onto a flash drive, then they bring it into their editing system where we just were they'll bring it into their system and their PSA or their TV commercial will have music that they created on their own. So anyway, let's go here. This is our last stop. This is our Tiger News set. This is where we have our, our weather person, our two anchors and our sports person. This is where they give the weather, the news, the sports, Everything um, is delivered from the desk. Each, each anchor has their own microphone, which is led into a box, goes into the audio control room. We've got three studio cameras, one camera for the two shot or the four shot. Camera three here would get the, the cross shot here on our weather person. Camera one here would get the cross shot on sports. So we have uh, typically two people running camera um, during any kind of given newscast, and uh, they kind of they kind of split the the duties on camera two just because camera two just gets the two and the four shot. So, uh, we have a TV screen here. Turn this on really quick. This just shows our our uh, Tiger News animated logo. We'll wait for that to come up. Um, a student painted this. Uh, Mr. Mathis, help me out. 
Lindsay Tudewall, is that her name? Lindsay Tudewall. Shout out to Lindsay Tudewall. She spent countless hours. Both of those panels. Yeah, both of these. Lindsay Tudewall painted this. I'll, uh, I'll send this video to her and she'll appreciate that. She painted this one and she painted this one and she said, Tauchi, just keep it for one year and I'll be happy. So I think we're going on year four here. So uh, here's our animated logo. That will go away here in just a second. So we have Tiger News, we've got our two anchors standing here, giving the news to 2,239 kids. Uh, we have our teleprompter area, we have our uh, monitor where we can see the, the show going on. This couch we use sometimes for interviews, sometimes we'll bring down, like the homecoming court has uh, a section of the show coming up next week. So. They may sit, they may stand, we don't know, but it's a pretty nice, comfortable couch. And then over here, this is our green screen. This is where our weather person, oh, I'm losing my voice. Our weather person will give the weather and our special effects class will also use this green screen for their specialized project. We use Adobe After Effects. And uh, so basically what we do is we tell a camera not to see that color green and if you stand in the green and you're filming, you can erase the green that's behind me. So it's pretty cool and uh, students like to use it and we've had some pretty cool uh, weather people come in here. Julian, shout out to Julian Rosoko, Levi Johnson. That's all I can remember right now. So uh, our white wall, we, uh, I'm not gonna stand on the white because I just painted this. But uh, we'll, sometimes we'll record interviews on here. We can backlight it with, with a colored light, with a gel or whatever. And uh, so it works well for us and uh, gives us some opportunities. We can also film here, erase the background, and put whatever, whatever else we want on there. So um, that's, a, that's a huge look at our department. And uh, thanks for watching.